Welcome or welcome back to Watch Advice on YouTube. It's Alexander speaking, your host, and with me is Edouard Milan, the CEO of uh, H Mozensi. H Mozensi, as you see in the background, and it's also written very rare, and what you will see is rare again. Edouard will present us the novelties. Two watches are in front of us. Yeah, only yeah. two this year. I mean, we need to focus on the on the rest. Production is is tight at the moment. We need to supply uh, watches to our partners and collectors who are waiting for our watches. So we only present two novelties this year. It's about to you to discover them now, and Edouard and me will disappear from your screen now because at Watch Advisor the watches are the stars and not us. So. You will hear the voice of Edouard, my voice, and you will see the watches on your screen in 4K as big as possible. Enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe and to hit the bell to get our latest notifications. So these are the novelties for Watches and Wonders 2022 for H Moser NC. You have the special Endeavor Center Second concept Lime Green, but also the spectacular Pioneer Cylindrical Tourbillon Skeleton. Which one do we start with? We're going to start with the Endeavour Center Second. An incredible green dial. So Moser is known for Fumida, right? And we've seen in the recent years that Fumida is that Moser brought back to light uh, about 10, 15 years ago. It's yeah. becoming very popular right now. So yeah, we see, want I see, I see many of them. I know. So we need to push the boundaries. I still believe we have the most beautiful Fumidals. The traditional Fumidal from Moser is a sunburst Fumidal with a galvanic uh, treatment. Here we have something very special. It's an animal dial. The way we produce this dial is by uh, having a gold plate. The base is a gold plate hammered. And on top of that, we set um, three different pigments of animal, vitreous animal. We set them on the plate slowly. It takes quite a lot of time to create this gradient. And then the plate has to go 12 times in the oven to create this very vibrant color. This is depth. You can see really the structure below um, and also this gradient, as I said, from a light green at the center to the dark green. I'm trying my best with the light we have to have no reflections and to be able to show this perfectly. But it shows. I think it does. It's, you see it here. It, it's, it's filmed in 4K. so. People will be able to really magnify if they want and really probably discover all the pixels <laughs> themselves one by one. Something special that a lot of people don't know is if you look carefully, and I hope you can with this light, you will see that the, the center second hand is slightly purple. This is a special code at H. Moser that tells you that this case is made out of steel. But obviously, if we were to make the same watch in gold, it would look very similar. So we have decided to create this with. Uh, this is, a this bit, is the code that you find in all our steel. Yeah, but it's a bit challenging now for me to um, show. It's challenging. It's very subtle, but it's beautiful. Now it's a 40 millimeter. Yeah. It's made, as I said, obviously as of steel. It comes on a beautiful uh, kudu light gray uh, band. You saw the crown. It's uh, it's automatic in center second. It's 11.7 millimeter. Height, uh, of height. You see the beautiful M on our crown and the lugs. Moser is known for those beautiful free forms on the side. Every uh, case is, is made really three dimensional with a lot of detail, a lot of craft. Then, if we look at the back, of course, it's a manufactured movement. It's Moser, we're known for our amazing engines. This is an automatic in house three hertz movement. If you notice, there's something very special it's the escapement bridge. At Moser, we produce hairsprings and we specialize in escapements. And you notice that this one is, and I think you can see it, it's a bright blue with two port piton. Two port piton means that there are two hairsprings and it's specialty of Moser for I'm some sure of the is. most accurate uh, watches that we have. The second one. Yes, exactly. So we this code in steel watches means that we have a, the blue bridge means a double hairspring. So it's two hairsprings that we set. We actually produce them together as a pair and then we put them together in opposition of phase so that they compensate each other. The resultant of the force of each um, hairspring when they beat, you see the beating there with the, the balance wheel. Each, ba each uh, hairspring has the tendency in pulling in one direction. But because this, they're almost identical, they are at the same time pulling with the same force in opposite directions, which allows the center, the axe of the, the balance wheel, to remain at the center of the stone and therefore minimize the imprecision and, the, and all the, um, the friction 
in the SK. This is something very Moser, this is very special, and uh, this makes it, this watch, yes, very minimalistic when you look at this beautiful green dial, but at the same time very complex from a movement standpoint. We can see the hairspring breathing, We're zooming in here. Going the into hair details. springs. Hair springs, but one of them I can see at least very clearly on They're my really monitor. on top of each other. These are the, some of the smallest hair springs out there. Um, yeah. We have the machines and the capabilities to do that in house. And we actually supply, believe it or not, about 25 other brands. Many of them are here at Watches and Wonders because we produce close to 200,000 hair springs per year. That's impressive. Uh, it is. It's Moser Engineering. It's Precision Engineering. Precision, Precision, sorry. Yeah. Precision Engineering, not Moser. Precision I think Engineering. It would, it would be worse the next video. You have to come to Schaffhausen and have a look at our facility. If you would uh, do this, that would be gorgeous. It's all about transparency at uh, Moser, so you're more than welcome um, to come and visit. To, to learn about hairspring manufacturing or producing hairspring, that would be gorgeous. Yes. It's a deal? It's a deal. It's a deal. Okay. So expect the video coming uh, where we really show you how hair springs are done. Okay, fascinating automatic rotor with uh, 18. 18 karat gold, signed H. Moser and C. Is there also the hallmark? You see, since 1828, all our movements have this hallmark. You see it. Here it is. Perfect. We have it. Yes, all our movements, the official one. It was a good way to uh, recognize the, the fake from the real uh, already uh, 150 years ago was to use this SK hallmark. The uh, Endeavour Center second concept lime green is retailing at 25,000 Swiss francs. Was including taxes? Yes. Okay. In Switzerland. In Switzerland, yes. That's why Euro is slightly more in Euros yeah, yeah, because, because there's unfortunately more. higher tax. Yeah. 19% in Germany, 20 in Austria and so on. Well, one last look at this beautiful green dial. It's like if you would look into a Garden of Eden <laughs> so great it is. I mean, that's the, that's going to be the nickname of that watch. <laughs>
even the indexes are not flat. They are made of globalite. Remember, I think we had already videos on globalite yeah, yeah, yeah. with you, Alexander. It's actually ceramic charged with superluminova and molded individually and then set on our dial. So these monolites, if we were to take um, flashlight, it would uh, glow very nicely in the dark. Guys, we're turning off the lights. Stay tuned. Oh, this is like in the club, right? I'm trying to charge here. Ooh. Yes, there we go. And then you can see really how three-dimensional they are also, looking at the side. Okay. That's a different light now. That's the light of the booth of Moza, but you still, you could see the loom shot. Oh, there you go. There you go. You see the global... Global light. Global light. So ceramic with super luminous. There's hand anglage, for example, on the, on the tourbillon cage. There's beautiful finishing, uh, brushed zonglage on the rest of the skeleton. It's kind of anthracite, which is very important uh, to give this very modern touch, yet with a very traditional uh, type of movement. Beautiful rotor, a little bit different from the previous one because uh, we wanted to give you the possibility to see as much as possible from the back. We see the, the open barrel, you can see the bearing holding the, the, the tourbillon as well and holding as well the, the rotor. Beautifully skeletonized, very, very close to the sapphire crystal. It's, it's impressive when you look at it, how you can really appreciate all the elements of the, of the movement. What's nice also with this watch is that it, it's very practical. It's spectacular, but it's 120 meter water resistant. It's a 42.8 millimeter. 42.8? Yeah, millimeter. Yeah. And it has uh, a height of 12.7 millimeter without the glass. It has a screw down crown. It's automatic. It's better. You see also the beautiful shapes on the side. Here on a crocodile strap, but you can have, we have a beautiful rubber, very practical in the summer or when it's humid. You also have a, a metal bracelet with micro adjustment that you can put on this watch. So very versatile. It's very easy to wear. It's quite a reasonable price as well. Guess the price. Yeah, a lot of people, lot of people were, were quite surprised. I, 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 don't, I don't dare to say anything. <laughs> Surprise me. So we, we are at, at, uh, it's not limited, but we are at 79,000 Swiss francs. Of course, it's a lot of money, but you get a lot of watch for that. It's very few will be made. Uh, 83,000 euros. Um, yeah, a beautiful and amazing and quite spectacular watch. It's a traditional funky blue dial. It's a light uh, sunburst, so our signature. Right. Funky blue. Yeah. One thing I didn't mention, and you see it because of the reflection of the lights, it's actually a slightly curved sapphire. So there's a slight curve on there. So it makes it very three dimensional. Again, it's a spectacular watch, yet you can wear it every day. It fits under the shirt. You can go swimming with it. Extremely practical. There you go. And as you said, you can choose uh, a rubber strap or a metal bracelet. Or a bracelet. But it doesn't come with all the options. It's not sold for the price with the free No, you, you would have to you, add, you to add uh, the, especially the bracelet. And the bracelet? I'm sure you can negotiate a strap with your retailer if you're nice to, to them. <laughs> but I'm not sure the, the bracelet. It's a little bit of, a little bit more, but I don't know the exact price. I'm very bad at prices, but around 2,500 or something. Okay. Very, very, very nice. I, last, last thing. I, I again want to try to show this uh, cylinder. cylindrical spring. Maybe when you come to visit the facilities with the hairspring production, then we can show you the escapement alone, because we have also some prototypes. But I think, I think everybody should be able to see what yes. Edouard is talking about. You see here, cylindrical hairspring, it's not flat, it's yeah, 4K, so if you're watching, you can magnify what you see without pixeling it. Well, I think this is a nice last picture. <laughs> so, be, yeah, not, not many novelties at H. Moser this year no, so but far, spectacular. but spectacular ones. Yeah. So, and very the Garden of Eden. <laughs> the Garden of Eden and the Octopus. <laughs> yeah, but, well, thank you very much for watching this uh, presentation of Moser Novelties. Edouard, the CEO, was the second voice you heard in the video. Thank you very much, Edouard, for taking the time. Well, thank you for taking the time. And uh, yeah, stay tuned on Watch Advice on YouTube. Uh, leave your comments, ask your questions, and uh, see you back here on our channel very soon. Bye bye.